In 2004, the President and Congress declared October to be Cybersecurity Awareness Month. As our lives become more integrated with technology, the threats of cyber attacks keep us on our toes. KUJH's Abby Lord has more details on how to stay safe on the Internet. According to Get Astra, there are more than 800,000 cyber attacks per year. Every 39 seconds, there's a hacker attack. And 4.1 million websites have malware at any given time. Students are most likely to click on spam emails or get fished with an estimated 3.4 billion spam emails sent every day. KUIT's Jake Kaufman, the deputy chief of IT, explains what the worst case scenario could be for the university. Attacks is choose your own adventure when it comes to that. So the worst case scenario that you can think of is probably the worst case scenario that could possibly happen. In order to protect yourself from cyber attacks, here's a few tips. Have a strong password that no one could guess. Stay away from sketchy websites and do not give your personal information to these websites. As well as add an extra multi-layered security that will add that second extra layer of protection. On the other side of KU at the engineering school, this summer, the Board of Regents approved the Bachelor of Science in Cybersecurity Engineering. The program will go in-depth to protect the world from hacking, ransomware, and phishing. Eric Perrins, the professor and chair of the Electrical Engineering and Computer Science Department, explains how excited he is about the new degree. Again, there was just only a handful of places nationwide that offer this kind of a degree, and so this is definitely the right move. There has been a lot of interest in the new degree, according to parents. Technology is ever-changing and protecting your data is easier than ever with these few tips. If you want to be more armed with tools, there's even a new degree to help you accomplish the best data security. For KUJH, I'm Abby Lord. If you want more information about the new cybersecurity degree, email eecsinfo at ku.edu.